Sports. Gary, the state GOP says they listened to activists in March by moving the event to Boone to lower the cost and reduce the pay to play mentality. Since then, the straw poll has received criticism on its relevance in the first in the nation state. And with big names not signing up, the GOP says it's listening to candidates. Elizabeth, good evening from Drake University, where the Paris attacks are on the minds of everyone and not just those on stage tonight. We actually had students behind us holding signs that said Iowa stands with Paris and Drake stands with France. They sure are, Morgan. As you mentioned, 13 days until the February 1st Iowa caucuses, and both races couldn't be tighter. I'm James Stratton in Wilton, where Ted Cruz just wrapped up speaking to hundreds here at the Wilton Community Center. He was introduced by Senator Chuck Grassley and went on from there. We're just about 72 hours away from the first vote Monday night at 7 o'clock. Tiffany, good morning. We're part of the, the media frenzy that's camping out here in Des Moines. We'll have team coverage tonight on KWQC. Today, David, we have 10 candidates who will be in the viewing area, starting down south. David, good morning. This is the pregame show, if you will, as we're about 14, 13 hours away from caucus night. You can see behind me in the West End Architectural Salvage Building, there's a live audience that you'll see at the Today Show. James, all eyes are on the Hawkeye State today. That might be an understatement, Morgan. This place is packed. Des Moines is packed. All eyes throughout the nation are looking at us, looking at Iowans to see who they're going to decide tonight, including the Today Show. Extremely close, David. We'll break down the GOP side first. Donald Trump actually won the QCA counties in our viewing area. 5,400 votes to 5,100 votes from Ted Cruz. Ted Cruz did win Cedar County and Henry County, though. Marco Rubio actually took Scott County. Now we'll flip over to the GOP side of things, or excuse me, the Democratic side of things as we zoom in on Iowa. Bernie Sanders actually took most of the QCA. Hillary Clinton won to the north and to the south in Louisa County. Morgan, and in the event of a tie, that's what you get. A <laughs> coin flip was used to decide the winner at Hayes Elementary. Flipped it with people standing around. You can actually hear a man say, don't touch it, don't touch it, no one touch it. 